What is up guys, my name is Mad Phoenix and I am back with some more Night Blights. So, as you guys know, I had to restart, so last time I played through Monday, or did, no, I didn't play through Monday last time, I played through Friday last time, but because I had to restart, um, I played through Monday on the live stream. Yeah, that, that was where I did it. Um, so now I have to play through the whole game again. Um, not particularly enjoyable, but I mean, you know, it does have certain replay value. I can just skip that. Um, I'm going to try to get both um, Tuesday and Wednesday done. But one thing I'm finding about this game is it's actually harder once you... Oh, wait. My baby brother is a teddy bear? It's... My baby brother is a teddy bear. That is... That's different. That's... That's new. I never actually looked over the crib before. I've always just kind of gotten the night blight and... Well, just gotten the night blight. I've never actually inspected what was in the crib. And all that's in there is a teddy bear. Is it possible that I could actually be alone in this house? That it's just me and the night lights and no one else? And that this whole thing is just a nightmare? I don't know, but there's my baby brother. So I need to run up and go kill a night blight. Not necessarily kill him as put him to sleep. Literally. He's gonna sleep. You're gonna sleep. There you go. Have fun sleeping. I heard laughing. I don't like hearing laughing. That normally means bad stuff. There we go, let's just... Alright, I'm coming. I'll feed you. It's the upstairs bite. Why did it have to be the upstairs bite? Alright, you're fed. Have fun with that toy you just ate. You know, you're not supposed to eat toys. You're, pr I'm pretty sure you're supposed to, you know, play with them. But I mean, you know, you're a night blight. To you, it doesn't make a difference. Playing, eating, it's all the same. That's baby bro. So let's go and get him. Or... Well, apparently that's the teddy bear. Because apparently, Baby Brother doesn't exist. Apparently it's just a teddy bear. I find that kind of disconcerting, though. It's like, why? Why? Like, that's the teddy bear, then the teddy bear isn't there, too. Like, just why? Because all that's in there is a blanket and a teddy bear. I, I, I'm just having problems grasping that. Why? Just why? It's probably me just overthinking things. Feed you? Okay, I'll, I'm, I'll come feed you. And how do I know when I put the my hand under the bed to give the night blight a toy that it won't chop off my hand that's another question I have for you sm a small child you are awfully trusting of these creatures that want to kill you also why are they even giving him a chance to like do this because it's like they could just one could get in then wake all the others up, then it would be a lot easier. That's that's something that's always curious in video games. Why do they always give the children, or not? It's not always children. Sometimes it's just why do they give the antagonist a chance? 
because they always know that they could just finish it before it starts. I heard you honk. How you doing, car? Because that's always something that bugs me. Like, what? What? Makes them want to give you a chance. A chance of survival. A chance to win. And that's just kind of the question. That's kind of the question of the universe why and that's the TV I didn't freak out as bad as I normally do with that though so that's that's good there's a toy up there let's see if I can get it There we go. Boom. Uh, let's put that down. Let's close this wardrobe. I heard laughing. Okay, you're hungry. Have a toy. Oh wait, that was that, that was downstairs. That was downstairs. That sounded a little too far away. And how does the sister not wake up? Assuming there is a sister and that's not just an empty bed. Because th that's something that's really confusing me now. Like, is am I really a toddler? And are there actually people in this house besides me? Or is this just a nightmare? A game, if you will. Well, I mean, I know it's just a video game, but still, like... Uh, the, um, that's wardrobe and that's thing, garage, garage door. I will take care of garage door because garage door comes open faster. Oh, that car's eyes. That is weird. Uh, that that that's not like the Chevron cars that are cute. Even though that was kind of cute, but it was just. Uh, why did it have to have eyes? Why does anything have to have eyes? Why do we have to have eyes? Why am I asking so many questions this episode? I don't know. Oh, that was almost open. That was not good for me. I need to check the fridge. I haven't checked. Oh, wait, no, I have checked the fridge recently. <laughs> okay. Anyways, let's. Oh, oh. As soon as I start flying away, the baby brother decides to wake up. Come on, baby bro. I'm coming. Ah, okay, there we go. All right. Oh, oh, geez. Stool is kind of stuck in the railing. Oh, geez. There we go. Oh, nope, 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 nope. That did not work. Oh, geez. Hey there, I see you. Get out of my window. There we go. Night plates. Oh, that that's the gay ridge. The gay ridge. The gay rage. The the gay ridge. You know, these nights are too slow paced. Like like I I know what I was saying that they were um like the the Thursday and Friday were too fast paced, but it's like after playing those, these are like so slow. Kind of boring. Oh crap. That the fridge is almost open. I wonder, can I pick up that companion cube if I fly up there? Oh, 
Oh, that's baby brother, baby brother. Oh crap, oh crap, no, 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 I'm falling down the stairs. I am not supposed to do that. I was half expecting to... That was a wardrobe in here, wasn't it? Yes, it was. I was half expecting to die there because it, because you guys remember last Friday episode. Um, okay, well I beat I beat the night, and and the uh, <laughs> the timer didn't make me jump like it did last time. That like every time I'm just like so intense into th this that the timer I just like I hear it and I think I'm dead so I like jump back and then oh it's just the timer. <laughs> okay, um so Wednesday. Um, how long have I been going? Like, I don't think it was that long, honestly. Um, uh, I don't have a timer. I think that might have been like, what, 10 minutes maybe? One second, I'll check. I'll be right back. All right, so that was 11 minutes to complete that night. So I'm going to go for Wednesday now. All right, I know what to do. Um, smoke is bad. Fireplace equals quiet. You know, I never noticed any noise when the fireplace wasn't lit. I should probably check into that. That sounded like a wardrobe downstairs. But I'm not gonna go downstairs yet because I need to gather some toys. I need to gather some toys. Oh, that's a wardrobe right there. I can do that. All right, so now I am, I'm, I'm noticing how important stools are now because they allow you to fly. Because if you stand on a stool, then pick it up. Oh, jeez. Dang, you wake up hungry for your midnight snack. It's only 11 o'clock, you know, right? Alright, so then let's drop. Oh, dang, that's still disconcerting. You know, they need to put fall damage into the, into the version they're going to release on Steam. That is something they should implement because it's like... That was laughing, that was laughing, that was laughing. I don't like laughing. I do not like laughing. Why was, why was laughing? Why laugh? Jeez, you're up early. Me likey laughy no no. That was a very coherent sentence I just spoke. Like, every time I close a wardrobe, it slams. So, how do, like, the parents of this child... Well, still operating under the theory that this is real. Uh, um, the child's not just making this up. And, um, and that there are actually night lights in the house. Um, under those pretenses... Okay, I can't pick up the commanding cube. But, um... Oh, that was the toilet. That was, that is the loudest toilet climbing expedition I've ever heard. Normally, it's a little more subtle than that. I don't know how it's going to be coming out to um to you guys though, because the volume levels for you guys are different than for me. Um, because I need to balance out my voice um so that you guys can hear me, and then I also need to balance out the toilet level. Well, not just the toilet level, but the whole thing. Okay, why are you guys laughing so much tonight? Honestly, it's it's not good. I mean, it's not, it's not even scaring me as much as just making me confused. Like, why is that ambience playing so much? Wait, I hear breathing. Is that the fridge? Yeah, that's the fridge.
All right, toy fly. Wait, ambience can sometimes pass through floors. Oh no. Let's get. Oh jeez. Hey there. Hey there. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Oh, what are you doing there? I've seen you before. Last time you didn't kill me, but wh how do I get? What do I do about you? What do I do about you? I'm really curious about that. Okay, you just go away. Okay. That works. That was downstairs. I also noticed that the baby's room got darker. Alright, so let's grab this toy. I don't know if that's bad. Oh, hey there. How you doing? Come on. Why can't I close you? There we go. Haven't heard from the garage yet. I'm gonna go check my baby brother's room, though. Because it got darker in there. And I don't think that's good. Heisenberg. Uh, oh, it brightened up again. Baby brother, are you sleeping tight tonight? Sleeping tight? Sleeping well. It's well. I, I don't know what I was trying to go for there, but oh well. Haven't heard from the toilet much either. Uh, what is that link? Okay, that works. There's a toy right here. Let's pick it up. Also, I haven't gotten a phone call yet. Oh, that's the toilet. That is most definitely the toilet. It's louder than I remember, though. I, I am saying that. it The toilet is louder than I remember. All right, let's pick up the Furby, and let's go. I've always found Furbies to be creepy. Like, is, is that, a, is that a, other people's feelings, too, that Furbies are rather creepy? Like, I never liked Furbies. Honestly, like, I don't know. Aren't they copyrighted too? So how did the guy put them into this game? Because I think that was downstairs. Oh no, it was upstairs. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, no, no. Fireplace. Fireplace is out. Oh my gosh. I already got used to leaving uh, leaving the fireplace alone. Alright. You have him fed. Hey there. Oh, oh my gosh, whoa. Okay, well that's the first time I've died on Wednesday, that is for sure. Oh. Okay, so I got used to not having to worry about the fireplace. That did not work out well for me. In the end. Uh, fireplace. You know, I always get like so entwined in all the other stuff that I forget to look at the fireplace. That's probably where the laughing was coming from, too. Okay. That works. Yeah, I got significantly louder, though, that breathing. So I thought, uh, I'm just gonna run away. I'm gonna run through the door. That door was not a good thing for me. It wasn't. Well, anyways, I'm gonna beat this a night next time. So, my name is Mad Phoenix, and I have been playing Night Blights. Um, if you guys want to see more of this, make sure to like, favorite, and subscribe. Um, and you can also um go visit my Twitch play, uh, page or my Facebook page. Um, there, those links are on my channel too. Um, uh, I haven't really been announcing that, but those are on there. You can just go click them if you want, and if you don't want to, then you can just go and watch some more of my videos. Um, if you are not subscribed, it's like I said, make sure to go subscribe right now, because um, for daily content, um, this content comes out on Thursdays, so, well, you're watching it on a Thursday. If you're watching it on a Thursday, that means it just came out. But anyways, my name is Mad Phoenix, and I will see you guys in the next video, which will probably be the SCP Containment Breach next video. Yeah. I am not doing good on this outro today, but anyways, I, uh, yeah, bye, bye bye, I'm, I'm, I'm done trying, I'm done trying. <laughs>